Marie Perigo. What loneliness can do Since I've been away I have loved you more each day Walking back to happiness whoop oh yeah Said goodbye to loneliness whoop oh yeah I never knew I missed you Now I know what I must do Walking back to happiness I shared with Crafty Sig, eh? Do you want one? Nah, no, go on then. The doctor told me I'd pack these in, you know, when I have my stroke. <laughs> it's all right for them sat in the semi-detached houses, guzzling red wine. Excuse Shots. me, love. Excuse me. Hiya. Hiya. See you now. Take care. Oh, yeah, mind how you go. I that, you know. I think how Rosie still changes his catheters. Mm. It's been right good with me, you know, I Rosie. It's bad, you know, when you lose your sight and your hearing oh, from one side. Bad, isn't it? Yeah? God? Yeah. Mm. Sure it is. <sighs> there you two are. Vault would find you out here, Nana. Uh, it's his vault. Here, there you go. Done. See you later, Chuck. All right. Bye. There you are, dear. Right, well, next one. Thanks very much. Ooh. So, what are you trying to sell me then? Well, I'm not, I'm, I'm not a salesman. Oh, so, so I'm, I'm kind of more into solutions, you know. Ah, solutions, eh? Yeah. Solutions, solutions, solutions. Everybody has got solutions for everything nowadays. Yeah, I suppose. Just a minute. Hello? Uh, no, 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 I'm sorry. Can't talk just now. Yeah. I'll get back to you later. Okay, ring you later. Oh, sorry about that. No worries. So, tell me. How do you find your heat bills? I'll be doing that usually. She earns money as a cabaret singer, but the way councils fund what she calls poncy arts projects makes her want to scream. The money they spend sometimes is absolutely ludicrous and it's, it should be stopped. Marie, it's going to cost £95 to have something called a thermal experience. Have you ever had a thermal experience? No, and would you pay price I would not pay. I, I, they must have extraordinarily good wages down here that can afford that. I know we can't. So, Marie, off you go. How can they justify the amount of money that they spend every year on topping the wine cellars up? They have to, to uh, entertain these dignitaries. They cost about £2.50 a bottle to buy when they bought them. They're now worth £2,500. But if you put them in front of someone like Chirac, he thinks, good gracious, I've been given a fantastic honour by having a bottle of wine like that. Why, when they've got that amount of money lying in a cellar, they can't sell a, an amount of it to plow it back into something in the, that's needed in this country, like, you know, helping out hospitals, things like that?